just initial thoughts on uh, the signing and uh, yeah. back at it. Yeah, I'm excited uh, uh, to, to be back here and uh, have a chance to play with those guys. Uh, this is this has been like a, a great uh, the last like three weeks with uh, you know meeting all the new young guys and all the energy they bring on the ice. Uh, I'm pretty excited for the for the start of the season. Is this all about hard work and determination to get this done? Yeah, especially with the way it ended in Edmonton last year. I wanted to, you know I took a, a few weeks off and. I, I worked really hard uh, back in Montreal this summer to, to be ready for, for a camp or be ready to play, and I didn't want to end it uh, in the, like the way it ended in Edmonton last year, and uh, I wanted to prove myself that I, I can go a little further, and uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to stay ready here. I know um, it's, it's pretty clear that the conversation I had with DJ, it's uh, what my role is going to be, and I'm, I'm going to try to stay ready, and you know, it's, a, it's a long season, and... I'm going to try to help this team uh, when I'm going to be in the lineup. Players know, right, when it's time to go one way or the other, and obviously you still had a thought that yeah. it was the other. Yeah, well, it's the, my, the, the start that I had last year in Philly, it's like, uh, I, play, I was playing really well and I got hurt. And uh, like I said, like in Edmonton, it didn't really end really well. But like I knew I, I, I could play still, and I took my summer really seriously. And uh, I, I showed up here, and I... You know, I, I got a good opportunity. They were, they, DJ was pretty fair with me, and I really appreciate that. Uh, you know, he's, he's really respectful uh, of his players and everything, and that's what I liked uh, about that. Is it going to be different if, like he said, you're a third, you know, one night you're playing, next night maybe sitting? Is that something that you have to adjust to? Uh, well, the last few years I've, I've, I've been doing that, but... Uh, yeah, like I said, it's a long season. There's going to be ups and downs. Uh, I'm going to try to bring my experience, even if I'm not playing. And it's it's the energy that you bring and uh, whatever. It's it's everything start with practice and the preparation. Uh, but yeah, once my name's going to be out there, I'm going to have to go out there and perform uh, wherever I'm going to play in the lineup. And uh, yeah, that's 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 what I like. Everything's clear, and I'm, I'm accepting everything. And that's what everyone's doing here with the, with this team. The buy-in is there. And that's why we're going to have success this year. Who is still here from the playoff? Or no, that next year, the two when they're here. I the lot is years. just Shabbat, I think. Yeah. yeah. And Shabby was still playing in junior, and I think we called him up or something like that. Or he was he was at the team. He was around the team. But uh, yeah, it's uh, it's crazy how like, like the time flies uh, pretty quick here. And uh, yeah, it's uh, we're we're ready to, to for for Thursday. It's going to be fun. It's, it was a good training camp. It was pretty competitive, and uh, you know today was a it was a good practice. And uh, we're going to have a few few more days here and trying to to have a good start of the season. What, what was that moment like when DJ kind of tells everyone, "Hey, I called you in the middle at the end." And yeah, well, I knew before practice, but I I didn't know he was calling out. Like I didn't know like he was going to bring me in in the middle of the stretch there. Uh, but yeah, I guess it was done uh, during practice, and uh, yeah, I was just honestly I was just coming here to, to get a contract, and I'm I'm pretty excited to be here. When's the last time you had a pri- you had the white jersey? You put the black one over. I had it every color today. Yeah, you had every color. Uh, have you ever had a practice where you wore? A <laughs> no, that's what I said to Pierre uh, during practice. I I was white, black, red. Every I played every position today, but uh, yeah, that's that's <laughs> there's going to be days like that during the season. Uh, you got to help out, um, and yeah, I'm, I'm a hockey player, I guess. <laughs> puck moving defenseman. Yeah, puck moving. <laughs> it was pretty hard out there. Like when the guys are forechecking me on the, on the back end, that's a, it's yeah. I'm, I'm, I better I'm better in a, as a forward, I think. Just a fun uh, part of your the, career. Fun part in your professional life here right now. Yeah, it's. Uh, I mean, this is, I think, season 15 for me, and uh, I'm pretty passionate about hockey in general, the game, and uh, you know, and that's like I said, I, I wanted to prove myself I was still capable of playing. And um, sometimes you're asking like the the, old, the older guys, the guys that have been retiring for a while, and they always say like, play as long as you yeah. can, you know. And uh, I think that was my mindset when I started this the, this summer. Uh, mentally, it was it was really challenging last year, especially like the the. the 18 weeks at the hotel in Minton, but uh, when I came back in Montreal after two weeks, I wanted to get back out there and uh, you know playing in our three-on-three league and starting uh, to skate with my skating coach, skill coach, and everything. I I love the game and um, 
yeah, I, I feel that same passion like with all the other young guys here in our group. So that's that's pretty exciting for me as an older guy to come here and. Uh, Um, yeah, just, I'm just excited for everything to start here. Y a un moment dans quel entraînement où ton mindset a changé et tu as commencé à te sentir vraiment confiant et à l'aise que les choses allaient se passer comme tu voulais? Euh, oui, euh, tu sais, la, la le premier match à, à Toronto, pour, pour tous les joueurs en général, c'est un petit peu plus difficile. C'est la première, la première match que l'intensité est, est un petit peu plus haute. Ça fait des mois que tu n'as pas joué. Euh, dans cette intensité-là. Puis là, j'ai trouvé genre, mon match avec oh, oh, ouais, ça On respectait que la deuxième, ça allait un petit peu mieux. Puis là, ça a commencé avec des pratiques, tout ça. Là, ma préparation était mieux. Puis il y a une journée que j'ai embarqué avec Giroud de Brinkett à pratique. Puis j'ai connu vraiment une bonne, une bonne pratique. Puis euh, la, la, je pense que c'est la game d'après qu'on a joué à Ottawa, euh, Montréal, ici. Puis là, j'ai joué un bon match. Uh, c'est là, là comme j'ai comme senti un peu que le momentum allait commencer. Uh, ah ouais, c'était uh, honnêtement, je suis vraiment content. Uh, j'ai j'ai travaillé fort, puis uh, toutes les toutes les, les, les journées d'été, puis uh, ça, ça a porté fruit, puis je suis content là-dessus. C'est une bonne pratique. Il ne faut pas sous-estimer l'importance parce que quand tu vas être justement dans le line-up, ça du line-up, des fois ça va te prendre des bonnes journées comme ça pour te remettre. Ah oui, ouais, ça c'est sûr, certain. Euh, quand ça va faire, peut-être une semaine ou deux, j'avais pas joué, dépendamment de comment l'équipe va ou, ou s'il n'y a, a pas de blessure, on, on espère pas ça. Mais euh, c'est sûr qu'il va falloir que je travaille plus fort euh, pendant les pratiques, après pratique, que ce soit avec le, le gars dans le gymnase, pour être, pour être sûr que quand, quand, ça, quand je vais avoir la chance de jouer, je suis prêt à jouer parce que l'intensité va être haute pas mal. Puis, euh, Ah oui, ça va être à moi de, de travailler avec les, les, les coachs puis le strength coach, faire sûr que, que je suis en, en bonne shape. Puis, euh, ouais, on va voir comment ça va se dérouler. À quel point tu es reconnaissant envers euh, Claude, justement, qui t'a comme un peu attiré ici? Oui, parce qu'au début, euh, ouais, c'est ça. Au début, je ne sais pas que j'allais pas venir, mais je pense que avoir le, une couple de, 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 de textes de, de Claude puis de Thomas, puis tout ça, je pense que ça, ça l'a aidé à, à pencher à venir ici. Puis, euh, uh, je respecte beaucoup uh, Claude. Ça fait des années que je joue, à, je joue contre lui, puis que je compétitionne contre lui. Puis c'est probablement des, des, des joueurs de hockey puis de personnes que je respecte le plus. Puis uh, juste d'avoir la, la chance de jouer encore avec lui cette année. Je sais que l'année passée, ça n'a pas duré longtemps, mais c'est quelque chose qui m'excitait encore. Puis uh, ouais, c'est sûr que ça, ça, ça a penché. Mais uh, le, le, le fait de, de connaître les trainers, de connaître le staff, uh, Ça, ça aussi, ça a penché dans la balance aussi. Puis que je, je, je suis pas loin de la famille aussi. Euh, J'ai tanné un peu de me promener à gauche et à droite. Puis je dois avoir le, tu sais, quand tu, tu joues pour plusieurs équipes, des fois, tu perds le sentiment d'appartenance à une équipe. Puis, tu sais, ces équipes-là, j'ai grandi à l'autre bord, bord du pont. Puis j'ai eu la chance de jouer ici. On a quasiment, on est quasiment rendu en finale de la Coupe. Puis je me sentais confortable de revenir ici. Puis c'est comme de revenir un peu à la maison. Et puis ça, mentalement, je pense que ça m'a fait du bien. Là. Tu vas checker ton club aussi, les Olympiques. Oui, de temps en temps, c'est sûr, on est dans les day off, euh, je vais avoir la chance d'aller les voir jouer. Puis euh, ça va être, le, je pense, une belle expérience encore pour ma famille de pouvoir d'avoir la chance de pouvoir venir me voir jouer. Avec le COVID, je, je pense que ça fait deux ans que ma, mes parents, ils m'ont pas venu, ils m'ont pas vu jouer au hockey. Fait que, euh, pour ça, ça va, être, ça va être le fun. Puis le boss qui a été créé à travers l'équipe euh, cet été avec tous les joueurs. Euh, Ça, je le sens, puis euh, ça, va être, ça devrait être une, une bonne année et une belle atmosphère ici cette, euh, à l'arène. On se trouve une dernière. En anglais, tu as dit que DJ t'explique clairement c'est quoi ton rôle. Tu es capable de le résumer? Oui, ça, je peux, je peux jouer au centre, je peux jouer à, je peux jouer à l'aile aussi. Puis euh, euh, quand je vais jouer, je peux aider en, en avantage numérique, je peux prendre des face-off, je peux jouer un peu partout dans le line-up. Puis euh, je pense que. Je pense qu'il voulait m'essayer aussi, là, les games que j'ai joué avec Giroud, puis euh, Debrinkat, puis la game que j'ai joué avec, euh, avec, avec Batterson, la dernière game, puis Pinto. Euh, <coughs> C'est juste pour essayer de démontrer que j'étais capable de jouer s'il y a quelque chose qui arrivait dans le top 9 ou dans le top 6. Puis euh, je pense que ça va être un peu ça mon rôle. Je peux jouer un peu partout dans, dans, dans le line-up. Puis euh, euh, je, je suis correct avec ça, évidemment. Mais il a été, euh, je pense qu'il m'a été vraiment correct avec moi. Tout était clair, puis il m'a donné, donné une vraie chance. C'était pas une... C'est pas juste une invitation, mais en tout cas, c'est sûr. Your thought on, on Derek Broussard getting that deal and what that's like for uh, for your group? Obviously, we're happy for him, first thing. Uh, well deserved. I think he played great. Uh, uh, battle really hard all training camp in the games that he got in. He played different situation and make the best out of it. So 
real happy for him and obviously just to add him I think it's just a guy that's been around for years he's been here before um, and just just guys that have so much uh, experience like him I think it's just going to help us uh, along the along the season and also add depth to our lineup so um, I think obviously we're really happy how, how would you rate him as a defenseman those not great today, but I uh, kind of got thrown in the fire. A few drills, he wasn't sure what was going on. So, uh, but you know what? We, uh, for us as D's, we love seeing that. Everybody, uh, the Fords always uh, complain at the end of practice that their practice is hard and our, ours is easy. So, he loved seeing a, a four going down there and struggling a little bit. But uh, no, I think it was all fun. When you first came up, you did room with him, right? Is that right? Yeah, yeah. yeah when, I, when I first came. Uh, when I was 19, actually, I started the year. I got sent down after, but um, I lived with him. And then my first pro year uh, here on the team, uh, I lived with him until the trade deadline. Sorry, until the uh, trade deadline uh, when he got traded to Pittsburgh. So um, obviously seeing him coming back here, I think he's done so many great things for me. Uh, he's helped me so much coming into the league. And um, obviously seeing him coming back here, obviously was everybody was pretty happy. Uh, knows the staff, knows every uh, everybody that's uh, still here. So, uh, no, like I said, I think it's just going to be really good for, for our lineup. We have some young players and ha adding uh, older guys like that. It, it just uh, it just helps us along uh, for the long run for this season. What would you like to accomplish as a group in uh, Trombone in the next two days? I mean, we, we were lucky enough to just go out east. I think we spent a lot of time together, but obviously going to Trombone is just spend some time and, and just... Uh, talking and getting to know each other. Obviously, we, we've done that uh, uh, quite a, quite lots uh, already, but I think you just never get uh, enough of it. And uh, we have a, no a lot of new faces. We have some younger guys. We have uh, uh, whatever it might be. You just want everybody to feel included and everybody to, to, to get to know each other and talk together. So, um, But no, it's something that we're looking forward to. It's always fun to spend some time with the guys. How would you assess training camp and, and preseason games? It was good. Um, Obviously, uh, we had so many games that it was kind of a, a, a weird kind of training camp in some ways because of the travel and, and this and that. But um, I think we got what we wanted out of it. I think we got a, a lot of skating. Uh, guys Guys did a great job first thing coming into camp in really good shape. And I think everybody was happy with that. And obviously, uh, carried on for the preseason game. We played well. We, um, Like I said, we have some new guys. Everybody's trying to get adjusted to, to the new systems and everything and get to know the the coaching staff and everything and, and uh, their line mates or D partners. So, no, it's been good overall. Obviously, we're really excited to get things going here. Oui, c'est sûr que oui. Je n'avais parlé au courant de l'été. Je pense que c'était quelqu'un qui voulait, euh, quand j'avais parlé avec Brass au courant de l'été, il voulait vraiment venir ici. Euh, on s'était parlé au courant de la saison passée. Il aimait beaucoup euh, comme avec l'équipe, euh, la direction que l'équipe s'en allait, euh, évidemment avec le talent qu'on avait en tant que jeune, puis euh, les éditions évidemment qu'on a faites au cours de l'été. Euh, fait que c'est ça, je l'ai mentionné. Puis je pense euh, quand, euh, quand j'ai vu qu'elle a été invitée ici, j'étais confiant en lui. Je savais qu'elle allait être capable de starter une place. Euh, Évidemment, est... il est d'une situation différente que la dernière fois qu'il est venu, mais tu sais, euh, comme j'ai dit tantôt, un gars avec de l'expérience comme lui, c'est un gars qui comprend ça, puis euh, il est prêt à prendre le rôle qu'il va avoir dans l'équipe, puis il faut le mieux qu'il peut de ça. Ouais. Bon, il faut peut-être qu'il y ait pas mal plus de francophones que l'équipe, pas mal, un 4, plus ouais. un qui parle français aussi. Oui, ça faisait longtemps qu'on avait eu euh, beaucoup de Québécois comme ça, mais non, je pense au... Euh, en général, comme j'ai dit tantôt, on a passé beaucoup de temps, les gars ensemble, à tout ça prendre en connaître, puis tout le monde s'entend très bien ensemble. Je pense que c'est ça qui est le plus important, c'est euh, d'essayer de bâtir quelque chose le plus tôt possible pour, euh, quand on commence la saison, bien, on, on, on est prêt, tout le monde se connaît, puis on est prêt euh, à commencer à jouer du mieux qu'on peut. How would you describe your, your training camp and, uh, and pre-season? Uh, obviously, uh, it's been a little bit up and down. Uh, I've had some good games, some bad games. I feel like I've been uh, progressing the whole time. Last game, uh, during uh, Moncton, uh, Moncton, right? Gander. Yeah, Gander. 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 Yeah. Uh, I felt I felt pretty good. Uh, I felt like uh, every practice had gotten better. Uh, energy is back from from being sick there right before camp. Uh, so it's just uh, it's it's been a progress, and I feel like I'm uh, I'm back on track. Based on uh, how you finished last year and the new contract, uh, how focused were you in the off season? Oh, I mean, like it was a it was a huge difference. Obviously, uh, knowing I'm coming back to the same spot I've uh, 
been the uh, past uh, year and a half. Uh, I know all the guys, and uh, uh, I was just so excited to come back see everyone and uh, get these things going. And obviously, uh, seeing all the moves going down this summer too uh, made it a lot more exciting to come back. Um, so uh, I've been uh, putting in a lot of work in the summers uh, or in the summer. Uh, so uh, I'm prepared. You also got a chance to meet two new goaltenders that you have to work with to start this year. Yeah, there's something with wire pickups, huh? Yeah. <laughs> and the sweets. Yeah. And the sweets. Yeah. Uh, now that unfortunate, that one that was unfortunate with uh, Cam there, uh, kind of an unlucky balance there. Uh, but hopefully he's back soon. Uh, it's uh, it's good to have Heli here. Uh, he's a great guy. Uh, didn't know him before, so it's it's good to get to know that as Swede. Uh, <laughs> and uh, we've had a good time so far. Does your mindset change, though, like a um, chance for you to play a lot here rather than maybe a dual system here? How does that change your mind? He hasn't really changed anything. Uh, my plan was, was to play good enough to, to get to play games anyways. Uh, I want to play at the same level as I did last year uh, and, uh, and keep winning games. Uh, so I wouldn't say no matter, like, that doesn't really change anything for me. Like I, w I just want to go out there and uh, and uh, give the team a chance to win every night. Um, and that's what I'm working for every day. You look at the schedule, the first month or so, there's not any back-to-back, -back, so how, how ready are you to carry the ball, I guess? I'll play whenever he wants with you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I'm just wondering about uh, Jake Sanderson's potential impact on this team. And, and I know it's early. What have you seen out of him uh, that can maybe calm things down on the back end? Well, he has uh, he's a lot of poise to the puck. Uh, he's, he's a great skater. He reads the game really well. Uh, he moves the puck well as well. So I, uh, I, I'm really impressed, and uh, um, it'll be exciting to see him, see him play this year. And uh, my, my last question for you would be, uh, it looks like Saturday night there's a chance it might be you uh, versus Matt Murray, and I'm just wondering what that would be like, just from having you know, shared a crease with him, um, how you would approach that game uh, against a guy that obviously you got to know pretty well. In, in, in I mean, I wouldn't. I wouldn't approach the game in a different from from any other game. Uh, it's the same thing. It's about two points, uh, and, and it's Toronto. Uh, we obviously want to win every game. Uh, it's fun to play someone that you know, and uh, he's a good friend of mine. So uh, obviously, it's exciting. But just to get get the whole season started is exciting. So. Uh, that doesn't change anything. Same with facing Craig Anderson, I guess, for the first game before. Yeah, I mean, I don't know him personally. I wasn't here when when he was here, but uh, I've heard from all the guys here. He's a, he's a, he's been good here for a long time, and uh, it's kind of a legend here. So uh, it'll be fun uh, to face him too.